Hello everyone and welcome to the show. Alright, so are you sick of zombies? Well, me too, kinda, but hey, as long as we're still gonna be listening or looking at them, we might as well, uh, you know, just check it up, check out the stuff, even if we're kinda sick of it. I mean, <clears throat> I mean, like, uh, they're about to run out sooner or later, right? Anyway, um, the subject for here is I, Z Z is I Zombie. I first heard about the show coming to on CW, and uh, then and I was just thinking, yeah, that sounds interesting. I guess I don't know. I should at least be able to get some laughs out of it. Then I found the comic that it was based on. I was like, yeah, it's based on a comic. Hmm. Okay, that should be. I I check this stuff. I'll check this out. The uh, setting is, um, well, about this girl named Gwen who's, you know, a sit, a, who's uh, living in Eugene, Oregon, and, you know, she just has a, a sort of regular life. She has a boyfriend who's a were-terrier, yes, a were-terrier, and a best friend who is a, who's a ghost. And there's also stuff about a, a coven of of vampire vampiresses that are going around and sucking people's blood and there's some hunters from a place called the corporation and blah 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 one of them one of the hunters has uh, hots for Gwyn and uh yeah <clears throat> oh no wait actually I don't think he's the wear terrier is her boyfriend it's just a boy who happens to be her friend or whatever anyway um and, um, that's pretty much it, you know. She eventually comes into contact with this other person who tells her that she's not really a zombie, technically, but actually like a revenant. And we get into this whole complex thing of upper and lower souls, and it's just weird. Um, but there are certain funny moments, certain, uh, funny, you know, times, um, yeah. It's just sort of okay. The show, I'm going to check it out. Maybe I'll do a vlog on it. You know, see how I feel. Um, although, from what I've heard, look, seen from the trailers, I can tell that there's most likely going to be some differences. The one most notable is the... You know, the Gwen in the comics is a grave digger. You know, so she can, like, dig up bodies and get their graves and get a and get their brains out and eat them about like once every month or so, month or so so she can like retain her sanity and doesn't turn into one of those you know rambling you know brain type zo brain eating zombies although in this one she appears to be like working in a morgue I think you know and uh, but that's really the only difference I can really discern and, um, you know, I don't know if they're going to talk into, like, how she became a zombie. Because, like, in this book, like, she was just already a zombie to begin with. And, um, yeah. But, I don't know. Uh, my overall rating for this is, I'm going to say, a 4 out of 5. A comfortable recommendation. Like, it's not super, f you know, hilarious, you know. But it occasionally gets a few, a few chuckles out, and, uh, yeah. And, you know, everything just works, and, yeah. Um, as for the show, well, I haven't seen it yet, but it looks interesting, and, again, I might do a vlog on it on, like, a video review type thing on it. Yeah. And so forth. Anyway, um... Next time, we're going to be getting a little Trekkie up in here, the Star Trek manga. Until then, see you later. Keep yourselves awesome by going out and supporting your local bookstores and libraries with your patronage and money and so forth. And have a nice day.